So I had to be home before midnight, or I was in deep trouble. So I walk in the door, right? I'm trying to be quiet, but she's right there staring at me, pissed off already. Like, she knows. I don't know how she found out, but she knows. And so she starts asking me all sorts of crazy questions, and it, it's pissing me off. Like, I'm getting mad at her, just staring there. Anyway, long story short, we get into a fight, and she ends up throwing a lampshade in my face. <laughs> you alright? Yeah, you alright? You like sports? You a baseball fan? Uh, sure. Um, my older brother and I went to Mariners games all the time when we lived up in Seattle. <laughs> Dude, my family loved the Sox. Best game I've ever been to, no question. 2004 ALCS Game 4. Sox versus the Yanks. You probably know where I'm going with this. Kinda. Um, not the specific game, though. Aw, oh, dude. Okay. We're down 3 0 in games in a best of seven series. The odds are stacked against us. It's the ninth inning and we're down by one. The Yanks just need one more out to make it to the World Series. I've never heard Fenway this quiet in my life. My heart was beating out of my chest. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Thank God we were able to pull out a run to tie the game and bring us into extras. All right, 12th inning, one of the clutchest hitters in baseball history. My boy, David Ortiz, steps up to the plate. Third pitch of the at-bat, I'll never forget this. They throw him a curveball in the inside corner and boom! Game over. Sox win. You probably know the rest, dude. We went on to win the series 7-6. It was the sickest comeback in sports history. You sure you're all right? Does this bother you at all? Yeah, of course it bothers me. I'm not a psychopath. But look, I get it, okay? You're uncomfortable. You're a rookie, but I need this money. And I know you need the money, okay? That's all there is to it. Any more questions? We could at least let him in the car with us. He's in the car. You mean like up front with us? Yeah, okay, we'll let him up front. We'll name the kid. Why don't we adopt him? We don't take him to parties and parks. It's... No. Do you actually enjoy his new movies? Well, obviously not, but I mean, you gotta look at the classics. You know, like Billy Madison, Happy Gilmore, Waterboy. Uh, Big Daddy had his moments. Three words for you, man. Grown Ups 2. That's two words. What are you talking about? Grown Ups, yeah, it's two words. Yeah, Grown Ups, and then the number two. How do you spell two? T-W-O. Exactly, it's a word. Yeah, like if I'm saying, I have two cats, but not when you're signifying a sequel. That's ridiculous. Without the two, it'd be the exact same title as the first movie. I'm not saying that it's not an important part of the title. I'm just saying it's not a word. Either way, did you see the movie? Yeah. Exactly. Where are you going? Just for a smoke. And you smoke in the car. Dude. Secondhand smoke kills. <laughs> Please let me go. Take it easy, man. He's just a kid. Oh, really? Like, any of this is about to matter? So we're really doing this? We 
it's easier.